Hey guys, Caleb Yonkers with Flow Theory Grappling. Today we're going to be attacking the far arm to sweep with a sumigayashi from Butterfly Half Guard. So let's get into it. We're going to be here in Butterfly Half Guard, right? and from here we're going to look to start off balancing our partner to get them posting, right? And anytime we need to get a hand to the mat, we can usually just threaten our partner's base, right? So if my partner's hands are on me and not on the mat, then usually, again, I can start threatening of taking him over, right? Which even if it's not a strong attempt, um, he'll, he will have to respect it and base out, right? Because if he just does not base out, right, he will go over, right? So, again, I'm not doing this to sweep him, but I am doing it to make him base out, right? So... From here, I switch from a cross shoulder post to a collar tie, hey, and I'm gonna be blocking this knee as well, right? Um, because I don't want him just basing out with the knee, I want him blocked at the knee, so the only thing he can base out with is the hand. Right? So I block the knee, right? and I act like I'm gonna try to sweep him over. From here, he bases out with that arm. Now from here, I'm gonna look to extract my knee, and now take this underhook. I'm gonna use the collar tie and the underhook to pull my partner flat, chest to chest, like so, right? And now from here, I'm gonna lock a gable grip right on my partner's rear delt here on the near side. And now make sure I flare my elbow out, right? If my partner can flare his arm out and base all the way out, yep. From here, he'll just be able to base and I won't be able to sweep him, right? So I, I wanna look to load my partner on top of me, right? Load him uh, as high as I can and flare my elbow. So when he goes to flare that arm out, he can't. Again, elbow low, he flares. Right. My elbow flares, okay, it keeps his arm up. And now from here, I look to use my shins to extend his uh, legs away. Right. And now from here, we can look to sweep him uh, over. And so again, right, butterfly half, right? Maybe my partner has hands on me. You can also use this if your partner all right, maybe has hands on your wrist and you, you have a hard time gripping, doing anything from here, All right? So if he doesn't want to take his hands off you, then use your hand to take his hand further in so that way he'll have to base, right? Because again, if he wants to keep on my hand, right? If he didn't, if he didn't let go of my hand, then he would go over. So they'll always let go of your hand from here, All right? So again, maybe he has my hand, All right? And now I look to, to get him elevated to try to make him base. All right, now that arm's based, again, make sure your knee is out. Uh, the last thing I want to do here is have my knee controlled by his knee, right? And now pull him in. If I pull him in without this knee being extracted, I'm just pulling him into a cross face, and he's going to pass me, right? The only thing that makes him being chest-to-chest -chest acceptable here is the fact that my knee is out, right? So now he can't pass half guard right? because he's not past his knee. So we, very important that we make sure that, that knee is out before we actually pull him onto us. All right, so again, one more time, right? Wherever his hands are, I'm gonna look to block the knee, right? Extend him out using the collar tie to really get him out this way. Again, right, my knee comes up. I go to the underhook pretty much simultaneously, like so. Again, gable, and now I'm just gonna keep him uh, chest to chest, my, my gable on his shoulder, and my elbow flared. So again, test this, have your partner see if they can get their, their uh, elbow or their arm flared, right? He can't, he can't base, but now we can extend. We can even start using his Garuma and, and blocks on the knee for even stronger finishes. Right. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, thoughts, please uh, leave them in the comments. It really helps the algorithm uh, so that we can continue to grow the channel. Uh, if there are any techniques you wanna see, again, let us know in the comments. Uh, subscribe, like, and thanks for watching.